Hey guys, welcome to another lesson of Pro Teaches Noob. Today I have with me Ingrid. Hello. And today we're going over something that should have won an Eisner Award, but was one of those that unfortunately got completely screwed over. Oh gosh. Yep, Stray Dogs. That's a bit one, the biggest surprise hit of last year. Uh, Interesting. Me, have you heard of this book? Not really, no. All right. Well, I'll just tell you, it's pretty intense. I guess we're about to see then. I want to make this very clear. I'm using, because uh, when, when, once they get the issue two, you'll see little watermarks for one of those, you know, scan, online scan sites. I want to make clear, I do have copies of them. All right. I do have copies. I just want, I but unfortunately, the one site I was getting the scan from, the second issue just would not load up. So I had to get one that had more obvious watermarks. All right, fair enough. It happens sometimes. Yep. So yeah, and let's open up now. Um, was chapter one, Good Girl. I should point out this is done by Tony Fleece, who's best known for being the artist on a bunch of My Little Pony comics. This is now. I'm not saying that this is his only time, his first time doing writing. He's done writing before, but this is his breakout moment. Oh, that's interesting. Yep, and just look at the artwork here, right? It is a pretty neat style. And Sophie, the doctor's ready for you. Hey, Sophie. Hey, good girl. You're here for... Okay, just... And, Bar and Bartella. E and easy. How's she feeling? She's feeling fr and frightened. Always. The whole drive here, she wouldn't stop trembling. I think the minute I put her in the car, she remembers she's going to get a shot. And then I'm scared she's going to hate me for doing this to her. Oh, don't worry. First... It's a proven fact that it's not possible for a dog to hate their person. Two, that's not how their memory works. Dogs remember you. They remember commands, where they sleep. But their short-term memory mostly doesn't hold on to, to, like, what happened last week. It's okay, girl. Good girl, Sophie. Just give her a couple of days. She won't remember a thing. Now, that's not ominous at all. Unfortunately, from what I understand, it is pretty true about dogs. Hmm. Then we see this big group of dogs. Master, food! Okay, okay, back up. I've got a surprise. It's okay, girl. It's okay. You're safe now. The rest of you be nice. I'll bring some food in a bit. New, new, new dog, new dog. No, no, stop. New dog, smells new. Hey, hey, back up. Everyone, be cool. Can't you see she's afraid? Hey, it's okay. You don't have to be scared. You're safe here. And there we go. See? I'm Rusty. Pleased to meet you. S Selfie. Wait. Have we? I feel like. Do I know you? I don't know. You really don't have to be scared. We're friends. I promise. Here. Meet everybody else. This is Victor. That's Gucci. And, and that's Henry. And other Henry. Hello. And Aldo. And Roxanne. That's killer, charmed, Imogen, and that old guy over there is Earl. <laughs> it's nice to meet you. This is the sunroom. We call it that because it gets the most sun. This is where we mostly hang out. It's where and it's where all the softest pillows are. Come on, follow me. We'll give you the grand tour. And basically, yeah, they show them around the place. Um, show them the big backyard. Fortunately, Sophie doesn't remember a lot of stuff. Um. And then eventually, though, um, when they're like, they're, and here's the bedroom. We all sleep in there with the master. But then, uh-oh, accident. Oh, not cool, new dog. Ugh, anyways, poor Sophie. Hmm. I, I know it's hard at first. We've all been there. All of us are rescues. We were all abandoned, too. But you really are safe now. The master will never throw you away like your, your your other people did. When you're ready, we're here for you. There you are. Did you find a little hiding spot? I've been looking all over for you. You hungry? Gosh, you're still shivering. Here, you must be so cold. There you go. <laughs> oh, no. I remember. Your master broke into my lady's house. And he waited for her. And when she came home, he he killed her and brought me here. Wait. Oh. Uh, yep. Uh, uh, 
and what what's happening? Imogen bit my foot. Imogen, you bit his foot. Okay, new dog's crazy. Got it. Yeah, what's wrong with you, new dog? Foolish. Hey, wait. Did we bury the stick? Like, hold on. Guys, she's just confused. Listen, I'm not listening to a second of this. This is a master. It's ridiculous. I could, I, I could smell everything. If he was a killer, I'd smell it. If he was a raccoon or a squirrel, I'd smell it. And I don't smell anything like that right now. Right now, all I smell is bullshit. Yeah, I'm with Earl on this one. He's been here forever. He'd remember if the master had ki been killing people, right? Earl can smell killers. Hey, don't worry. We know you've had a long day. I feel like you're probably just confused. I'm not confused, I. Bedtime. Come on, let's go. Everyone's ready. Come on. Ooh, now that's not a scary room. Mm. Sophie, Sophie, no, stop. Hey. Hey, listen, I want to help you. I don't know if I believe you or not, but I really can't think of a good reason you'd be lying. So we're going to figure this out. I know every corner of this place. If the master's done something like you say, we'll figure it out. And if he is a killer, I'm going to get us all out of here. Wait, what killer? What are you talking about? Oh, how's that for the first issue? Oh, boy. You can see the, com the complications of this, right? Indeed. It's so easy for these dogs to forget. Yeah. No, no. I remember. I was scared. You were nice to me. You and the others showed me around. And you told me everything was going to be okay. Oops. Uh, um, yeah. And then you told us that our master snuck into your house and murdered your lady. I don't... You don't remember? You said he took a scarf and he... Oh, stay right here. Scratch, 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 scratch. All right, all right. Calm down. Woof. <laughs> was that you snoring? I think it was Earl. Not me. Other Henry's the one who snores. I can't help it. I have a science condition. Okay, got it. What are you? Here. <gasps> all right, who's hungry? Private room? What's that? When you showed me the house, you said there was a room we weren't allowed in. Yeah, the master's private stuff room. We're not allowed in there. He, we think he keeps treats in there. That's why he keeps it locked up. Aldo! Oh, no. Oh, I don't. We, we have to get into that room. Good boy. You want to go for a ride? Mm. I have to get out of this house. I can't do that by myself. Your master killed my lady. I remember she, she... Okay, but none of these dogs believe me. If he's got this room, uh, a room we're not allowed in, there must be something in there. Kid, I get it. I want to help. But he keeps this door locked. There's no click. Usually he keeps it locked. You'll help me look? Look Look for what? This is This is a master's private stuff. If he finds out we're in here, though, there's going to be trouble. Uh, what's with all the lady stuff? That is concerning. <laughs> what is all this? I don't. Never been in here before. It just feels, it feels wrong. Do you feel it? I don't know. Feels like he's got a bunch of junk. But just, like, why did he have ladies' clothes? I don't know that either. To be honest, we don't really even know what his job is. He just goes to work. Well, it feels wrong. Sophie, I'm trying to believe you. I want to understand, but he's really, he's not a bad guy. I mean, he takes care of, good care of us. I can't see the master killing. Right, um, gah! Did, did the master kill this dog? That's a coyote. They're not dogs. They're wild animals. They're dangerous. The master protects dogs. He hunts wild animals. Okay, we need to hurry up. I haven't found it yet. Just a little longer. You don't even know what you're looking for. I'll know it when I find it. Oh, I love that. That does look something out of a cartoon, doesn't it? Mm-hmm. It's just getting late is all. We don't know how long until the ma- Hey! You know you're not allowed in here! What is this? Bad dog! <laughs> you get out of here! Get! Kick! Yay! Come on! Uh-oh, and- And stay out of this room! Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god! Who is this little guy? This is Earl. His bark is worse than his bite. Please do- No. It would be my pleasure saying- No. 
Who's this guy? Don't mind him. His bark is worse. His bite is worse than his. No. It looks like they made friends. Maybe we should too. No. Who? This little guy. This is. Who? Uh. Oh, hello. Who's this guy? He's not so tough as he. No. Who? <laughs> what? You're free. It's okay. Sophie, it's okay. Go ahead. Run. Oh, hello. Mm. What is it now? God damn it, Rusty! What the hell's going into you? Well, come on! What's going on? The bad thing. Rusty, he... It's punishment. Oh, Imogen. You keep, Imogen is going to be one of those where you're going to always, she's always going to be there, but she won't make a big difference until later. Hmm. Okay, bedtime. You need to go outside? You have to, anything to say for yourself, new dog? I'm sorry. Hold on. What's going on? New dog made Brust and Brusty break the rules. What? When was this? This afternoon. Brusty got punishment. I literally have no memory of this at all. You can come on in now. Now, too. Aww. Oh, my God. Are you okay? You're limping. No, it's nothing. It's nothing. It's fine. I'm fine. Aldo, what happened today when he took you out? Today? Nothing, really. All right. We went for a ride, and then we went to the dog park. At the dog park, the master and me met a lady and a dog. Then the lady and the dog left. We went on another ride. Then the master used his click box to make and pictures of the lady. Pictures of the... Is this her? No, no, not like that. She was different. Wait, then where did you get that picture? I remember her. That's my lady. Uh, oh no! The plot yeah. thickens. Yep. Oh, you, yeah, you should point out. I gotta show you later. There was a bunch of horror movie spoof uh, covers, all of them based off of different horror movies. Hmm. I know there's more in that room. We just have to get back in. I'm not going back in there. The master's room. What was it like? It's dark inside and stuffy and dusty. There's other pictures in there. Other ladies, not just yours. We have to just, we have to, if we can find more and the others, they'll believe. Yeah, but believe what? All we know is that the master has a room full of junk and he makes pictures of ladies. That's not, and we know he killed my lady and he killed Roxanne's, but we don't know that. Roxanne doesn't remember if he killed her or not and or if he just, I do. He did. I don't remember it clearly, but we lived in another place and it was softer and brighter. We had plants and he... I remember he came in my lady's room, and, and I completely forgot her. How could I forget? Rusty's right. He didn't forget because it never happened. Nobody's talking to you here, Earl. Keep on moving. Hey, hey, we all forgot. We all had other people, and we all forgot them. We just, we have to figure out a way to not forget again. Can we remind each other? If you keep my scarf and I keep your picture, can we? I'm afraid what will happen if we forget what those things mean. He's out there right now. What if he brings home another dog? Sophie, not every dog is from a... Oh, yeah? Where did you live before you lived here? I I don't... You don't remember? Well, I do, for now at least, and I need help. Are you going to help us, or are you... Master, food! All right, in. Listen, I am trying to help you. I mean, I took punishment to help you. I don't know what else I'm supposed to do. You don't believe me, and I can't... Shh. You smell that? What is it? I can't tell. It's too dark. Hey, what are you guys doing? Oh. No. Oh, no. What is? Oh, no. No, no, no. Hey, it's okay. Hey, hey, it's okay. We don't know what this is. Victor, get away from that door. Come on, Roxanne. Babe, you have to stop. The master. Roxanne, the master, he'll hear you. Oh, geez, look at the look on her face. Oh, no. Yeah. They, hi they hit in one of them. Shh. All right. And bark, 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 bark. Oh, Okay, all right. That was horrible. If he would have found us here, what? What would he do if he found us in here? We need to get back inside before he notices we're missing us. Guys? I can't get out without help. Yeah, if you didn't notice, he's missing a paw. Mm-hmm. Shit. That's not our only problem. I is that locked? 
He's bringing food out right now. We have to get out of here. But but it's locked. He uh, he will notice if we aren't up there. Roxanne, help! Dig 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 dig. Stop digging. There's there. Dig here. Okay okay. Back up. Dig 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 dig. dig. Rusty, Victor, we're in. There you are. Dinner. Jesus Christ, you're dirty. Guess we're doing baths and baths in the morning. What the fuck? We found. We think we found under the porch. There are piles of piles of dirt. We found graves. What? What kind of graves? People graves. Here you go again. You're being hysterical. You didn't find graves. What are you saying? There's dirt under the porch. That's what you found. I found this. Is is it your ladies? No, I don't know who. No, you don't know. Everyone smelled it. It's nothing. It's just a scrap of wait. I didn't. <laughs> uh, it's uh, you're going to be okay. No, it's all gone. Everything. We're going to take care of him. Isn't that right, Victor? We're to, we'll take and good care of the brave good boy. Aww, he was a rescue. Oh. No, don't, please, Victor! We have to get out of here right now. No, okay, we just need to make a plan. Yeah, we can just, no, there's no time for a plan. This, there's no time for, this is emergency. Oh, I know what to do. This, that's emergency. We touch that in, and the good people talk to us. We talk to them, and they come and help. Uh, uh, I, I've seen it a hundred times. So stupid. Victor, how do we talk to people? They can't even understand us. This won't work. Doesn't matter if they understand us. They always come anyway. The good people always try. We have to try. Hold on. Okay. Start over for me. You're saying that thing calls the people? <laughs> what? <laughs> Hello? 911? Is uh, emergency. Is someone there? Hello? Hello? Oh, no. I'm so sorry. It looks like my dog's actually knocked the receiver over. No, we're all okay here. No, you too. Thank you. Okay. Click. Mm. God damn it, Rusty. Why'd you let him do that? Victor? No. Me? How's this my fault? You're the one digging up graves because you're the leader. You're, you guys, you're supposed to. Oh my God, you guys. What? You guys, listen. Remember that toy I had, the orange one? Well, I haven't been able to find it anywhere. And now I'm thinking it's because Imogen is hidden. Yipe! Yeah, that's what you think happened, happened. Oh, no. Like Disney meets Psycho. That's a great way of putting it. Okay, okay, here, just for you. Shh, no barking. What? This is what he always does. Just because Master likes to look at the pictures he makes, that doesn't make him a, doesn't make him a killer. Hey, you guys okay? Are you hungry? Earl, how can you not see he's he's taking care of us all for, and well since so as long as I can remember because I'm like starving. How can you remember, Earl? Tell us you don't have and you don't like having a roof over your head, food to eat. The master takes care of. Wait, 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 wait. He's not going to feed us. Uh, I I haven't eaten anything since since Victor. He's going to kill us all. Oh, come on. He's not. He killed Victor last night, Earl. He just killed him like it was nothing. We don't know that. Victor could just be on punishment in the shed. We know. We heard him kill Victor. I saw him kill my lady. He killed Roxanne lady and Victor's lady and you are lying. He didn't do any of that. You're just confused. Of course you say that. His loyal dog. You're goddamn right I am. He's not a killer. I know it. I know him. I've been here since I was a pup and... Hmm? Imogen, what she, oh, I remember all of it. I remember the master. He'd always give me treats and he, and he, and what else? What do you remember? What kind of treat? Who else was there? Was it cold that day or warm? He was, it was, you don't understand. I remember, um, I remember. No, Earl, you don't. None of us do. I can't remember what my lady's voice sounded like anymore. See? She doesn't remember either. She's lying. She's got you all turned around on the master. He brings us food. He keeps us safe. None of this happened before she came around. She's lying about this, Anne. I'm not. Please, Earl, listen, I... I remember, too. What? 
Rusty. I remember. I lived in a different place. And I had a lady and she, the master, he came into our place and, and he killed her. He, we have to do something. We can't, we have to get out of here. Sophie's right. He'll kill uh, all of us if we, we can run, we'll run. No, no, no more talk like that. It's not true. Victor's not dead. If you guys run and try to run, if we try to run, what? You'll rat us out like you did, Victor? What? You told Master? Errol, that's not true, is it? I didn't mean I. No, I I don't remember. How could you? I, I said don't run. Sophie, stay. I'm not running. Then what are you doing? I'm going to see about Victor. Hold on, us two. Oh, and I do like how you see how he is torn because clearly he's only remembering selected memories. Mm hmm. You didn't remember the master killing anyone, did you? No, I didn't. But hey, hey, I smell something here. But they listen to me, and I believe you, remember? It smells like Victor right here. What is this? I'm telling you, it's Victor. Is it blood? Hold up, wait. Wait, he's somewhere else too. They don't know. He gave me treats. They don't know any. In there. Er. Uh, er, uh, I. Mm -hmm. Sophie, is he in there? Oh, geez. Uh, hold on. Ah, oh, geez. A page got missing. I guess I, I missed a page when I was gathering the scans. Hold on. Ah, here it is. Hold on. They're looking in there, like in there. They prop it open, and Sophie goes in. Like, why? Don't go in there. Why not? It's open. We don't ever. That's where that's that's punishment. Are you kidding me? He said Victor's in there. So that's where they go in for in there. Mm-hmm. Like, Sophie, is he in there? Sophie? Victor? Run! What is it? What is it? Just run! Please! Please! We can't stay here! Is it punishment? Well, now I gotta see. Wait! Please, just run! Please! Please don't! Oh! Oh, God. Oh, that's awful! Run! Wait! Hey, hey, we're trying to slamming themselves against the fences like what dogs do. Guides do! Get climb! Dig! We can dig! No, I've dug all over here. The fence it goes all the way down. Did you check the gate? It's locked. The front door. We can, but we're not allowed at the front door. Wait, what? Fast cars out there. Uh, my other Henry, we're not going doing the rules right now. We have to get out of. Mm -hmm. Can't. This one's locked too. We have to. If we could just. Oh no, master. Hide. Shh. Okay now. Shh. Here. Quiet. Help. <laughs> It's okay, Earl. It's okay. You're safe now. Now look at all these dogs here. New, new dog. Hey! Bad dog! And look. Ugh. Everyone. And Victor. All of those dogs he met. Eventually they were bad too. You know the rules. You don't ever come in this room, and you don't ever show me your goddamn teeth. Come on, you're unpunished. Like ah! And, what was that? Shh, that sound, hunting sound, just like Victor. Oh God! Oh no! Who's not here? Everyone's here except um, Imogen and Earl. Run! And run! Run now! What happened? Everything's locked. We can't get out of here. There has to be a way. Can't we dig? I think if we dig at the corner of the fence, we can, no, run. And then Imogen, like, like, ah, is he, we can't stay here to find out, but all the other doors are, I said, run. Oh God, Earl, is he okay? Be careful, sharp, Earl, run. Wait, I got it by my lady's scarf. What? No, it's upstairs. I can't leave it. I'll forget again. I'll, Sophie, no. It's okay, Sophie. It's okay. Go run. <laughs> run! Ah! He's shooting. Oh, God. Roxanne! I'm fine. Run! 
all these cars too fast. That's why we're not allowed out here. Fast cars, the master, they won't stop. Roxanne, wait, wait, help somebody. Ah! We can't get across today. How do we make them stop? Oh God, no. Ooh. Is he, oh no, Earl, is it, is he Earl? Why did you? I remembered. Oh gosh. Oh. Hello? I can't find my phone. Can you call 911? Sir? No, no, don't go near him. No, not safe. Sir? Sir, can you hear me? Are you okay? Sir? Oh. Uh, Hey, buddy. Hey, can someone get animal control to handle these dogs? Do you need help? Is there something I can? Oh, thank God. He in the house. There's a room upstairs. He, my lady, he out back. There's a shed and okay. Okay. Slow down one at a time. There are people buried under the perch. Whoa, champ. Perch and back? back in the backyard. Wait, are you guys okay? Where? Hey, Sheriff, you better come take a look at this. Yeah, we're okay. Time passes. Whoa, not so rough. That big guy could bite you in half. Hey, hey, wait. You're like, do I know you? Don't worry, he's good with other dogs. He's super chill. God, I wish she was chill. She's a holy terror. Look at her, completely fearless. Oh my goodness, she's so cute though. She may be the cutest thing on earth, and she's a rescue. Oh, ours too. We got him just four months ago, but feel like he's been part of the family forever. He's so handsome. Do you know how old he is? They say he's between six and nine years old, but we don't know for sure. He just, all right, time to go. Did you make a new best friend? Is he your boyfriend? Do you love him? Come on, Trudy, let's go home. You want to go home? Good girl. The end. How's that? And now, how is that for the main mini? Man, that was a really compelling story. We're not done yet. There's a prequel materials. Oh, interesting. Starting with the free comic book day story. The doggy in the window. Fritz, you just want and you just went out. I'm trying to work. There, you play, I work, okay? Are you serious? You're ridiculous. Okay, you know what? Let's just burn off some energy. Is this better, Fritzy? Are you excited to see all your friends? Oh come on, you kidding me? You're not gonna go run around. And you're not going to go run around? He's cute. He's impossible. German sh uh, Schuzer? Yeah, miniature. Say hi, Fritz. Or, you know, just sit there in the ground, in the grass. Which one's your dog? He's the gray one over there. Wait, Hunter? That's Mrs. Widow's dog. Are you related to the other gray one? Oh, I don't see, see the other. Hey, listen, we're going to... I have to get back to... They could play together sometime. Your dog and my dog. Sure, here at the... Or someplace out. Fritz, come on, boy. It's been nice. Nice to meet you. You see, that means Fritz was the first dog. Mm-hmm. And this guy realized you can't just fake it. Mm-hmm. Fritz, we literally just went out. Mm -hmm. It's okay, Fritz. It's okay. You're safe now. Oh, oh gosh! We well, we know what happened. Mm-hmm. And now this leads to Dog Days, which is a bunch of prequel stories for everyone, like Killer. Oh no! Oh no! No no! Please not the the monster! No 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 no! Kachink! No, it's the monster! It's the monster! It's the Killer! Jesus! Shush! It's me! It's it's the girl! It's my girl! Mom, I'm home! It's it's the monster! Uh, cuddle monster! <laughs> the monster! The monster! You're home and you brought my laundry. Are you okay? Is David hungry? David, are you hungry? The monster is starving. We probably should just let them finish this first. He gets so excited. Come say hi to your father. He wants to show you his new collection. It's, it's some people believe that this was the killer's family, the other killer's actual family, and that that's the father. Hmm. I don't know. I'm not sure on that one. Oh, yeah, Gucci. Um. Oh, look at that. 
so well again. Very tasteful. That expand payload contains too much sass. Oh, just look at it. That's a perfect, interesting way of telling the story, huh? Mm-hmm. But then, all right, don't, e don't even talk to her before she's had her morning coffee. <laughs> this is Stephanie's sister. Please, if anyone's seen Stephanie or Gucci anywhere, please contact Trey or me or my mom. Oh, man. Oh, gosh. Missing. Are you guys ready for this? You're not going to believe it. What? What is it? Look. I mean, look at this stick. Yo, this is the greatest stick I've ever seen. Can we? Also, may we please play with the stick? Please and play with what? No. What if you broke it? You want to trade me for it? Trade? What can we even? I mean, I have a tennis ball I could. Wait, I've got something. Oh. How cool is this? Ew, dude. That stick sucks. That's It's the worst. I think it's kind of cool. No, it's not. It's dumb. How could you even think that the stick is comparable to all those? Go put that thing back where you found it. How about it? You want to trade me for the, my tennis ball? For the ball? Absolutely. That's the greatest ball I've ever seen. Okay, cool. The ball's yours. The stick is mine. Even trade. Don't forget. Dude, I'm not going to forget. Uh, okay, what about, what would you trade me, would you trade me for this tennis ball? Ew, that ball sucks. Dude, come on. And then there's other Henry. Missing persons case earlier this summer. Police are asking for any information to contact Crime Stoppers. As well, Jay is another scorcher. Two words, son and screed. And then, oh, he had a cat with him. Monster Jesus. You big jerk. All right, okay, smile, you two. Oh, isn't that cute? <laughs> You got everything? ID, phone charger? Yes and yes. Love you. See you in two. Sir, and sir, please just, please, I have, please, no, please. Rawr, rawr. And poor monster. Steven, please, mm -hmm. you have to try and eat something. It's awful. It's just, oh. Oh. Flawed, he loved him. And, the, and monster loved Henry. Ah, that's just how cats are. They don't always show their affection in an overt way. Imogen. Imogen, oh my goodness. Okay, okay, we'll get up. Imogen. <laughs> oh goodness, Imogen, gracious. Imogen, leave that nice lady alone. Well, hello there, beautiful. <laughs> Imogen. <laughs> oh my goodness, Imogen, just sleep. Imogen, oh my god. Mm hmm? Mm, 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 mm. Poor Imogen. Used to be a ball full of energy, and I have a feeling she remembers more than she ever lets on. Mm-hmm. Because seriously, how do you go from being this kind of ball full of energy to that? Yeah. Roxanne. <gasps> Hello? Is someone in the house? Hello? I've already called the police. Hello? Listen, I'm warning you. I've got a very big dog, and she bites. Oh come on, Roxanne! It's like you like uh, it's it's like you live to smell like a trash pile. Oh no, no, let go! This came from Mom's garden. Get it! You know Mom's gone. I can't. Aww. Mm -hmm. Get a Malamut, they said. It'll be fun, they said. Oh no, where'd she go? There's my pretty girl. Thanks, Rita. Of course, hon. See you next time. Uh, next time. <laughs> Here, let me get that for you. Thank you. That's a beautiful dog. What's her name? New dog. Hi, I'm. Hey, what's your rush? Thank you, I. What's her name? Hey, what's her name? Roxanne, sit. Good girl. Oof. And then we get, um, other Henry, the male poodle. Hello? Is someone there? <laughs> it's okay. Shh. Duke, what? Ah, shit! Oh, my God! Uh, please! Wait, please, please, please! I've already called the police, Just I called the... Uh, uh, here. Treats. Cops are on their way. Please, just don't hurt my dog. Please, just... Just... What is it, Henry? What is it? Are you scared of the sirens? Oh, you're scared of the puddles, you big baby. Come on, just go pee and we'll go back inside. It's just rain, Henry. It's not going to kill you. Well, I gotta say, I'm glad we see one of his failures. Mm-hmm. 
And there's Sophie. Now, remember when um, Rusty said he thinks he uh, knows, knows her? Go ahead. Run. Oh, hello. Don't be scared. I'm nice to dogs. Would you like to be my dog? Maybe you two can be friends. Hey, come here. here come here. There he is. Meet Rusty. Hi. What's your name? Sophie. Pleased to meet you, Sophie. Oh, hey, don't have to be afraid. That stuff doesn't ever happen at the park. Plus, you're with me. I'm a rescue. That means I'm lucky. At least that's what the master says. Just not any dog, and just and not just any dog gets rescued. Are you a rescue? I don't, I don't know. I live with my lady. Oh, dogs who have ladies always get rescued. The master, master likes that kind. Wait, you have a man too? He doesn't look, and like dogs who have ma mans. He doesn't even let me play with them. Says they're too dangerous. Dangerous? Oh no. Are there dangerous dogs here too? Sure. A bunch of these dogs have man. But you don't have to worry. You're with me. And what am I? You're Rusty. That's right. And I'm Lucky. Also, that dog over there, there is Lucky too. That's just his name. We're not supposed to play with him. Do you know all these dogs? Yeah, a lot of them. Don't you? Is this your first time here? We've come here sometimes, but the other dogs, they're too big and so fast. And they play so rough. I just, I stay close to my lady. Man, we live with a bunch of dogs. Big ones, little ones, all kinds. Hey, maybe your lady will let you. Sophie, come on, time to go home. Oh, I have to go. It was nice. It was nice to meet you, Sophie. Good boy. You want to go for a ride? And then there's Earl. No, listen, I think the master, I just can't. Do any of you remember living anywhere else but here? Do you remember a lady? I have these. Hey, new dog. Heck, you want to go outside and goof around? Sure. Hey, is Lanny okay? She seems. Who knows? She's always going on about something or another. Boring! Hey, I've been trying to figure something out. Maybe you know. Hit me! When do we get treats? Oh, the master feeds us every day in the morning, and then again when it's dark. No, I mean treats. It's the same thing. No, it's not. Their treats are bigger. They're shaped differently. Do they taste the same? Kind of. Then what are we talking about? I know he has treats here somewhere. You're the one that, and and with that crazy nose, if uh, if he had them, you'd probably be able to smell them. Master. Oh, he's getting ready to go out. He doesn't like to be bothered when he's getting ready. Roman, look. Treat. Hey, oh, we think those are for his work. We never get those. Oh, good boy, Earl. Good boy. Where'd you guys go? Just downstairs. Where's Lanny? Did she finish her story? She got real frustrated and went to lie down. What's with the new dog? Oh, Master gave me treats. And this is the last one, Victor. <laughs> oh, hi, Victor. Yes, good boy. Uh, did you have a long day? We did too. Come on, let's get cleaned up. Well, that was brutal. Be careful, Victor. He's grumpy tonight. Hey, come on. And come. How come you're? How come you're not? We didn't even. It's fire. We can't beat them all. I don't know why we even try. Renee, seriously, get your dog away from me. Be nice to Victor. He loves you. And he's not my dog. He's the station's dog. Well, I don't love him back. And fire stations don't have Dalmatians. It's not the 1800s. Victor, come. We just, and we try because it's our job. Yeah, well, great job today. Don't listen to mean old Jackson, buddy. He's just sad. He loves you. Everybody loves you. Ooh, and this is where we see the after the main mini. Oh, boy. Renee would have loved this. She wouldn't have loved, she just would have loved seeing me try to read all this in front of all these people. When I'm called to duty, God, wherever flame, flames may rage, give me strength to save a life, whatever be at its age. Let me embrace a little child before it's too late or save an older person from the horror of that fate. And if according to your will, while on duty, I must answer death's call, Blessed with your protecting hand, my family, one and all. They they burned it. Hmm. So, what did you think? That was really, really good. Really intense, huh? Mm-hmm. Feels like perfectly paced, perfectly well timed, and it's such a unique concept. And at the same time, when you see the stars, you wouldn't expect anything until the end of that first issue. Then you're like, shit. Mm-hmm. 
I mean, okay, until you saw the end of uh, the first issue, what did you think happened? Hmm. I honestly thought it was going to go in the direction of he had a hoarding problem, where it's just like, oh, we were just going to see the rest of the house in ruins or whatnot. Yeah, but then once you find out, killed my ma my lady, that's where you're oh, like... Oh, yep. That's when it just hit that, oh, this this is going to be a twisted and kind the, of story. And even Earl, he wasn't a bad dog. He was loyal, but that's because he was bribed in the loyalty. Mm-hmm. Because clearly, he's the only dog the master gave treats regularly to. Mm-hmm. Because that's the one thing that stuck in his mind was, treats, treats. Because when you think about it, he's the only one that got bribed to look the other way. Yeah. Which is probably why he would always remember the treats and go to the master and the master would give it. Now, the master probably thought like, oh, yeah, here you go, boy. Mm -hmm. He probably didn't even realize he was bribing him. Yeah. But that master, what an asshole. Damn. And poor Victor. Indeed. So, who would you say was your favorite dog? I really liked Rusty. It's really hard to not like Rusty. I know. He felt like a Don Blues character, didn't he? Mm-hmm. This whole thing felt like Don Blues, but amped up a bit. Perhaps. You know, like, all dogs go to heaven and all that. Mm-hmm. Now, Imogen is still the biggest question mark still. Yeah. I think it's clear Imogen remembered a lot. Indeed. Probably remembered more than, I mean, if I remember right, don't, aren't those type of dogs better at remembering things? They might be, but I don't know dog breeds off the top of my head. Yep, uh, let me look at um, what kind of breed that dog was. Um, um, hold on. Oh yeah, and by the way, they're they are actually talking about making this into a movie. That would be neat. Oh, she's a Tibetan Mastiff. Hmm. Which um, hold on. Whoa, big dog. Big dog indeed. Yeah, I mean we already saw that, but um, hold on. Yeah, I think these dogs are more known for keeping their memories, I think. Hmm, fair enough. I mean, but, but yeah, though, I mean, and what did you think about those prequel stories? Oh, gosh, it's just like... Yeah, just seeing all those lives they've had. Although, I gotta say, I am not a fan of all those ones. The one with, you know, Killer finding the bow, and I'm just like, um, hmm. what was the point of that story? Yeah, that one kind of felt like it was going in circles. It did, but all the others felt like they have a point. That was the only one that felt like it had no point. Though I'd have to say the best one is the one where they had they had the one time that he failed, at least that we've seen. And then he went and went after I, I think that's why other Henry no no Henry, the poodle, has no probably no photos. It was probably a quick snatch. Indeed. But yeah, the scene him that was so worthy just to see that, yeah. He failed. He never. He, there were some he didn't get right. Yeah. And, and then the ending was the house burning down. I think that was perfect. Yeah, it's just like just gonna purge all of the ghosts that are in that place. And of course, yeah, murderer would so be spray painted on his um house. Yeah, I could totally see that happening. But again, poor Earl though. At the end, right? He just he finally mm. remembered, and then he sacrificed himself. Yeah. I, mean, I can't tell which was more painful. I think Victor, though, was a bit more painful. Yeah, because he was, like, the first death, and you just kind of saw that, yeah, well, he got that, butchered. Not, well, not just that. He was the he was the one being, he was being the fire dog. Uh-huh. He was actually being the one who was like, no, we got to get out of here. Like, once he remembered everything, he started acting like the brave fire dog that he was. Indeed. And then it just, it bit him. Now, how did the master probably, re probably because he was closer to the phone is probably why the master picked him. Because otherwise, there's no way the master would have known that he was the one who, you know, pressed it. Yeah, probably. Um, I also really liked Roxanne. Yeah. And um, now here's the question. Do you think there was something going on with Sophie and Rusty? Because it felt like there was. 
Mm. Although he did call Roxanne babe at one point, so. <laughs> mm. I mean, if you read between the lines. It's hard to tell. Yeah, but... it's ultimately not important for understanding the core of the story. I also realized we never found anything about Rusty's origin. We didn't, interestingly uh, enough. Yeah, I mean, when we saw him, we just saw him right before, when he first met Sophie and explained that, but we've never seen his owner and he doesn't remember it ever. Mm-hmm. But yeah, just, and but we did find out, never goes in with guys. Yeah. For, probably for some extremely twisted fetish reason. Like, the thing this reminded me of is Jojo's Bizarre Adventure Part 4, Diamond is Unbreakable, and the main villain we had there, Yoshikage Kira, who would kill women and then chop off their hands, because that was his weird fetish. That was sort of what that reminded me of. Right, right. But And the fact that the guy was just, he was nobody when you see him. Mm-hmm. You know, he just looked like an average bloke. Mm-hmm. I mean, and all that, and I will say, though, the fact that it took Earl's bite that finally killed him. Yeah. Irony. Was, yep, and I think he was lifting his hand off it because he was on impulse waving to the woman, like... Yeah. Probably because she was the first woman to actually approach him without needing the dog. Hmm, yeah. And I'm kind of getting a bit of an... I hate to say to use that word, an incel vibe from him. Ah, I mean, not wrong. Especially the fact that if he was willing to take his hand off to wave because she was wandering up to him, I think that's why. I think it was just simply like, woman's walking up to me. Uh, hi. But uh, yeah, so just... Now, Gooch, but guys like Gooch and all this stuff, it's clear they're just there to fill it in. Obviously, the main dogs are... Sophie, Rusty, Roxanne, Victor. Um, yeah, I just feel like those are the main ones. I mean, Imogen to a point. Mm hmm. Feels like Imogen had no purpose until the very end. Hmm. Because it felt like she just kept interrupting everything. Didn't it? Y yeah, I can see what you mean. So, yeah, I mean, I pretty much spoiled the whole thing, but would you be tempted to get your own copy? Hmm. Perhaps. I mean, I've been thinking of getting a new bookshelf since my old ones are crowded. Might as well have some more things to put on it. Yep, just to make it very clear, like I said, there's showed you there's two of them. One is Dog Days and the other is the main mini. Right. So, yeah, that's all we've got here. Actually, you know, before we go, I'm going to show you some of the um, movie spoof, the movie, the horror spoof posters. Hold on. Ooh. Hmm. Ooh. Pretty chilling, huh? Indeed. That's a lot of them. Oh, yeah. There's, there, there's a bunch more. But that's because each of the issues kept selling out. Oh, that's interesting. Oh, look, it's Victor. Victor's the one with the halo. Oh. Why you gotta pull on my heartstrings? It's that stay instead of it. Hmm. Of course, they had to do a Walking Dead. <laughs> Two of them. And then the other one's Balto. Of course, they had to do Balto. Stranger Things, Gremlins. <laughs> <laughs> The fog, um, and all that, just. <laughs> ah. <laughs> I 
All right, and then there's some more from the first mini. Um, hold on. Not as many, not as many. Oh, well, that, that's all for those. But, yeah, so, of course, there's no way to do a follow-up, I think, after all those. Yeah, there really isn't. But They've already closed all of the plot threads, so do, adapting it to a movie just kind of seems like the next logical move. And obviously, since they did Dog Days, they have more than enough to fill in stuff. Mm-hmm. I could definitely see this as a Halloween sort of release. Yep. I I just hope, 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 hope we can we get um 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 a good cast out of this and it is actually done theatrically, not a Netflix release. Yeah, that would definitely shift it. All right, well, thank you for joining me on this one, Ingrid, and thank you everyone. We'll see you all in the next lesson. Take care. Take care.